Yeah, alright, well, I think... It's reasonable to start putting some points into HP now. Uh, there is a couple of areas now where we have uh, ran into... Where we get royally smacked. House Marais is ruined, just des desert <laughs> for falling for that severed harpy. No surprise that Guilty Cretan took the castle and our storied sword. It's not deserts, just deserts for falling for that severed harpy. The surprise that Guilty Cretan took the castle. Wait, what? That one is ruined. We're falling for that severed harpy. What's a severed harpy? Does this have something to do with the prosthesis? When it says severed, does it mean like... Amputated? Oh shoot. It's a poison fog. Alright. What are you doing, man? That's news to me. <laughs> you can attack. God. What a turn. Priority. No. Yeah, I'm being summoned. Happens to uh, it's gang up on him. Like that. I was a bit cocky. Not gonna lie. By me. Made it seem like I'm some amazing PvP player. I'm not. I used the PvP a lot, I've said it before, I used the PvP a lot in Dark Souls 2 using Twin Blade. Twin Blade with a spell that... Um, 
would cause uh, buff my weapon with poison, I believe. Some poison or some dark flame thing. With some poison mist, I believe. I don't remember exactly, but it was a combination of things. I was using a sword that could cast magic. Which is something I'm kind of missing here. Like a dagger or something that can also use... Oh my god. Getting tired of the same enemy at all. Nice. I mean, you can clearly see how bored I am of watching the same annoying BS enemies over and over. I mean, come on, man. I think that's probably one of the... if not the camera, of course, but I think that's one of the greatest weaknesses of this game. Is the insane amount of just repeat content. can't imagine that an average person come on really Average gamer that has maybe some time here and there to play would be happy with the sheer amount of repeat content that this game offers. Because imagine if you set aside a little bit of time now and then, and then you just keep repeating. I mean, uh, running into like the same stuff over and over again, like the same caves and the same enemies. And then once in a while you see something uh, interesting or new. I guess that's where games like Sekiro or even Dark Souls 3 uh, are a bit better. Is the pacing of the game. Now I don't think Dark Souls 3 is a better than uh, Elden Ring. Not at all. I don't think Dark Souls 3 is a particularly good game. Elden Ring, I think, is a really good game, but it has its weaknesses. Sekiro is probably like the best game I've played in a very, very long time. Comparing that to uh, comparing anything to Sekiro is pretty rough. Of course. Are you?
I'll take. I shall take. Are you guys coming up? Or? a bit of a problem. Fumor's bottle line. Fighting two of them, maybe I could. Fighting three of them, we're talking problem now. Not gonna lie, their moveset's really cool. I just wish it didn't cost FP. It already has so many drawbacks, like limited use, quite long cast time, and you have to uh, mine or farm for resources, right? So. I don't think it was necessary to give it an FP cost as well. I'm sure some items need an FP cost, but I don't think the perfumer's bottles need an FP cost. I think the fact that they're bottles and it's like really like alchemy or herbology or whatever, or chemistry in general, should be lore wise an argument for why it shouldn't cost a fee. Well I know where that is. Then maybe I missed it in here somewhere. Ah, saw it. Go. Ladder 
trying to be sneaky. Try two-handing. Shadow spot over there looks like a person. I see you. Oh shit, these are the. Oh my god, these are the one shot guys. Okay, let's check what's up here. Actually, let's. Check what's out there first. Ah, that's a rub. I mean, the rot aren't dangerous or anything, just annoying. Perfumer's Cookbook 2. Alright, let's see. Stone, Grace Mimic, Gold Pickled... F oh, okay. We got that thing. We got the loot item. This one. Oh, no. It's runes. The silver one is a rune. Alright. Okay. I don't think that's necessary. I guess at least it is in this stage of the game to use it. With a bird farm, I think yeah, it's quite fast. I'm sure, the bird farm plus the scarab is uh, fast enough as it is. The heck, was it fighting? This kind of seems like it's kind of. Like, de getting de decrepit? Is that the word? Really? It is, I guess it's all that rot. The site I have one of, actually. It's the spear I don't have. I said the sword earlier. It's a spear I don't have. The sword I have plenty. <laughs> Odd place for statues, just...
I think it's dangerous. We're actually gonna have to do this full buff. So we don't die. Red branch bow, short bow I have on. Well, you have been nominated to give me back my uh, HP and FP. Those dogs plan to die anytime soon. Why exactly that move causes rot? I thought they were supposed to fight rot, or have they already been corrupted? That that spear must have rot on it. Isn't that a bit ridiculous? Well, I wouldn't know, because I don't have it. <laughs> Somebody that has the spear, please tell me. Does it have rot status on it? That seems a bit redonkulous, if you ask me, but... Okay, we got the shortcut. This place actually reminds me very much of, like, the Dark Souls 2 map design, which I really enjoyed. Ah. Click the wrong button, but ah, do you know what? I I feel a bit tired. Let's um, let's just try it legit tomorrow. Um, is there anything I can do now? Oh yeah, 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 of course. Of course, where's the library?
There we go. Dark Moon Ring. I might do like talismans, let's see. Oh, it's not. Ah, uh, key item, maybe? Ring of Lunar Princess Rani's Cold Oath. Ring depicting a leaden full moon. Look at that artwork, by the way. Amazing. Symbolic of a cold oath. The ring is supposed to be given by Lunar Princess Rani to her consort. Rani is an Empyrean, meaning her consort will be right by rights earned the title of Lord. A warning is engraved within. Whoever thou mayest be, take not the ring. From this place, the solitude beyond the night is better mine alone. Her consort. Art thou be not I would but I mean that's one of three, right? One is dead. For some reason. Which I don't really know. The other one is that giant. And then there is Blade. The wolf guy. And then me. So that leaves like three of us. I think I qualify as a consort. Well, my first walk. Lady Rani has departed on her journey along the dark path of the Empyrean from Rena's Rise, as she calls it. Now, Lady Rani, I pray that you. Actually, uh, read this uh, conversation. Off, off camera actually, my accent. I don't know. My gut feeling says Blade, but since I'm the main character, well, I'm not really the main character, but you know what I mean, I'm the playable character. I want to say it's me. Now, we've already been here. And we got her like her snow outfit. Remember this being here. <laughs> oh, of course. I mean, let's check it out. Is the ring maybe it is ours? Lake of Rot. I think that's. remember this. I think there was a seal here. I guess that seal vanished when I did something. Maybe when I went up to the... I don't know. I must have done something. Okay, I know where this is. I tried for a very, very long time to find a way up here by running around in that 
depressing place underneath where uh, that village was slaughtered. I'm too tired to... to explore this now. <laughs> but I just want to see something. Oh, we can summon help here. Asha, so something's gonna happen. Either way, ugh, it's getting late. Let's do that now. Let's do this. Um, I was gonna do one other thing as well. But I don't remember... Where it was... Where did I ride that coffin? Where did I get that scorpion dagger? This place looks amazing, I remember this. It's here, right? I think I read something, um, might be a spoiler, but something regarding that chest that if I use it again, it will lead me somewhere else. So. In the next episode, I'll go try taking that chest and see what happens. Could just be BS, I don't know. But we'll find out. Anyways, uh, it's getting late, I'm getting super tired. Uh, I need to go to bed. So, thanks for watching, I appreciate it. Hope you had a nice day and experience and blah blah blah. And, uh, see you in the next one, bye.